hey guys welcome back to my channel thank you for stopping by and if you're a new subscriber or if you're a newcomer here please join the family but if you're an old subscriber thank you for coming back and for those who are just passing for the first time please stop hit the subscribe button before you continue and i'm gonna love you for that too today's video is another um let's say fashion video and from my own point of view as usual um first of all i want to thank you guys so much for the response for my previous video so many people wrote to me personally and i really felt humbled and thank you guys so so much in fact i'm gonna be very honest with you i've been making videos now for a while but i think the last video that i uploaded was one of my realest videos and that's me that like that's my personality on that video and this just goes to show that i'm more comfortable now on youtube than before when i started and you know like I always say everything is you know when you start something you always take time to get used to it and I'm just getting used to YouTube now getting used to standing in front of the camera because trust me guys it's really weird for you to stand in front of the camera talking alone you know it's it's a weird feeling but anyways so firstly I'm gonna take you into my closet or what you think is a closet because I'm just gonna show you a small section of it and then we are going to go into the video and I'm going to show you what I want to show you in this video. So let's go. And mind you, the lighting in my closet is very, very bad. <laughs> so you're just going to manage. Hmm? Mm -hmm. So let's go. So I'm not showing you guys all my closet. I'm just showing you guys the little section where I have my jacket on. Because today's video, I'm going to focus on jacket and the essentials. Jacket, es es jacket essentials that I think everyone should have in their closet. I mean... I don't have much these are some of my jackets or trench coats or whatever winter jackets all together these are some not all because this place is a little bit too small but anyways this is how I organize them my closet is really awkward and there's no need to show you guys much more than this like seriously so let's just go back and yeah So today's video is going to be on jacket essentials that I think like everyone should have in their closet. Excuse. And before I start the video, a disclaimer as usual. Every idea or everything I'm putting out here is my personal opinion. I'm not asking you to go out and do or buy these things. These are just my ideas. If you don't need them, fine. If you need them, fine. So yeah, don't come at me. Because they are just ideas that come into my head and I just feel like, okay, I should share. So some of the ideas that I have, some of the jacket ideas that I have in my head, I don't have the jacket <laughs> in my closet. But I will, I can create a very good image for you that when you go to the market, you, you'll be able to get them or you'll know what to get. So the first essential that I think you should have in your closet, this one is a must. You need a blazer in your closet because it's very dressy and it just makes life easy. And the best color that I recommend to you is a black blazer. And this is what a blazer look like. looks like. This is what a blazer looks like. And it's just a fitted coat. <laughs> it's just a fitted coat if you can call it that. No, but it's called a blazer. So yeah, mine, I like my blazers really a body hugging so some people like to go a size up or two sizes up but it all depends on you for me when I put on my blazer or even a normal dress if I don't feel like I'm choking the next minute then I'm not feeling the dress so yeah but that's that that's just me so this is what it looks like unfortunately you guys can see everything but I'm just going to try to show you guys you know this so yeah and then the next jacket essential that I think you should have in your closet is um a denim jacket and that's what I don't have in my closet simply because when I just I don't know it's not my thing but I just feel like you you should have a denim jacket if you're someone who likes to follow trends you know because right now it's very trendy it's very in style and everybody is wearing denim jackets oversized den denim jackets to be precise for me it's not my style when I go to the shop you know I can really make up my mind that okay today I'm going to the shop and I'm I'm going to buy one but when I just get there and I see how big the thing is like it's, it's just not my thing, but if you're that kind of person, if you love denim, then I'll say go for it. If I ever wear a denim jacket, it's just going to be because I'm following the trend, not that I actually feel like I love it. No, I don't. It's not my thing, but 
that's another thing that is in style now you can dress it up you can dress it down it all depends on you i wish i had one to show you guys in this video how to dress it up but i promise that i'm going to do a lookbook very soon and i'll try to incorporate incorporate all those things inside so yeah the next thing i think you should have in your closet is the next kind of jacket you should have is um a leather jacket um for me a leather jacket just makes you look bad like you just have that biker vibe you know and it's really cool but for me i don't have anyone because i have the same feeling with uh, the, the the same feeling that i have with denims is the same feeling that i have with um leather jackets i just feel like they are too they are too overrated for no good reason you know so instead of a, a leather jacket this is what i have to show you guys this one right here is not a, a leather jacket but when i when i wear this i just feel like i have a biker jacket on and it just gives me the same vibe that a leather jacket could, could have given me and it's just i think it's a full suite the material is like it feels like a full suite but this part here is a normal material you know and it gives me the same vibe so you just need something like this this is so cool for spring and all that so yeah this also is very nice i think you should have this in your closet and this is also from zara by the way the previous uh blazer was also from zara the next jacket essential that i think you can or you should have in your collection is a bomber jacket this one i actually like and <clears throat> nowadays people go two sizes up to have that baggy effect but like i said i don't like it it's not my style i don't feel it so i pick my exact size and this is what I have here and I'm gonna show you guys how I actually wear this bomber jacket because I don't uh, regularly this is what this is how it's going to look like this is it like it's just something small and cool but this is how I wear my bomber jacket I wear mine like a crop top just because I always like to be extra and I give the illusion of a sleeveless crop top you know i just this is how i always wear it i wear it with a high-waisted jeans and this and then a little cleavage and then a little shoulder so it just makes everything sexy you know you know it all depends on you you can wear it the way you want you can dress it up you can dress it down but a bomber jacket is actually an essential in your jacket collection the next thing you need in your collection is a trench coat and this is what it looks like this is what a trench coat looks like and this is it a trench coat is one of those jackets that can just take you you know from a two to like an eight instantly because first of all i like the fact that it's long really long i like really long trench coats and it, it gives me the same effect like a kimono but almost in a classier way if you can understand what i'm trying to say it gives me that kind of feeling and i don't know it's just trendy nowadays for people to wear oversized things but it's just not my thing like i'm not feeling that vibe i just don't. first of all i'm a very small person i'm a <coughs> I'm really petite so there's no need for me to be wearing big things you know <clears throat> there are other things that i can do for people to see me you know because i know that we small people we always struggle for people to see us and me trust me i have ways I have ways that you notice me and you get so annoyed so I, don't, I don't i just don't need to wear big clothes for you to notice me so this is what a trench coat looks like this one is pretty long it's um after my knees and yeah it just takes you from you know from basic to almost bougie you know not completely bougie because this one is not that bougie this is a very basic trench coat but there are other sophisticated trench coats out there you know it just depends on you this one is from h&m and so was the bomber jacket that i just showed you guys they are both from h&m very affordable and then the next thing you need is a like a winter jacket legit winter jacket you need a winter jacket that you know when it comes to winter jackets you have your basic winter jacket that you can wear every day you can wear every day when you're going out and uh, something else that i forgot to say about trench coats there are so so many different kinds out there in the market there are sleeveless ones there are short sleeve sleeve uh, short sleeves uh trench coats and they are they are even um how do they i don't even know how to call them but there are some type of trench coats out there. I, I wish I could show you guys pictures, but just bear with me. Eh? Uh -huh. I'm very local like that. The next essential is your winter jacket. And you know, when it comes to winter jackets, like I was saying, you need a winter jacket that you can wear every day. Your everyday winter jacket that you take to, to work or that you take to school. And you also need a winter jacket that, you know, you can, you can wear to an occasion or for a night out or, you know. You just need a dressy winter jacket and you need a regular winter jacket and when it comes to that 
this is like something that I don't wear. This is not my everyday winter jacket, I beg. I know there are people out there who wear this one for their everyday use. But for me, this one, I wear it. <laughs> it's my winter jacket when I want to go out, when I want to go to some place really serious or when I want to look classy in winter. And trust me, it's really not that cold, but it's thick enough and it's classy enough and if you've been following me on following me on this channel or any of my social media you have you must have seen this jacket i've been wearing it like all the time like it's even getting old but this is just something that you need basically what i'm saying is that you need a winter jacket an outing winter jacket and a regular winter jacket so this is the one that i wear to places this for me is a must have because it takes you from zero to big to to body like it takes you from zero to bougie immediately it just makes you look flashy and classy at the same time and it's my honorable fur coat that almost killed me during my last video and this one when i wear this coat i just feel like a diva wear this coat I feel the need to buy a dog yes each time I wear this coat I feel the need to carry a dog because it, it gives me that feeling like you should just be like a diva and you have your small dog and you have your 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 water bottle and <laughs> oh my god the things that go on in my head eh? you don't need to know but you know you have you need this 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 kind of thing in your this full fur jacket in your in your collection because you know it takes you from zero to bougie and there are so different uh, there are so many different kinds of fur coats out there you have basic ones like this one this is basic you have sleeveless ones you have crop crop ones you know there are so many out there it just depends on you different colors but i personally loved this particular one because of the color and it's such a universal combination of colors it goes with everything you can dress it up you can dress it down so yeah this is something that I, I highly recommend that you have in your collection. This one is from Zara and Zara is one of those brands that you always, always, always have a fur, a full fur coat. You, even H&M too, they always have good ones, you know. And I always advise that if you want to buy a fur coat, full fur coat, coat from, oh my god, full fur coat from Zara, you should go there during sales. I bought this one during sales and it was really affordable, so yeah. The most important you should have in your collection is this kind of winter jacket. Especially if you're out here in in Finland, you need a winter coat. Like for real, for real. This is my everyday wearable winter coat, winter jacket. In fact, this is my winter blanket because it's, you know, the weight alone on this thing is real. The weight alone, you know. Even though it does not really do anything when it comes to cold in Finland, but, you know, it helps. So... This is something that you need in your collection and I like this one. I love the color. I just love the way it keeps me warm, you know. And this cap too, you know. This full fur, you know, full fur touch out here is giving me life. I just like it. It covers my ears and it's really nice. This one was a little bit pricey, but, you know, it was worth the, the cash and, yeah. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you like this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up. Um, leave your comments down below. Leave your thoughts down below on what you think or what you think I should have added in this video or your own ideas. So yeah, guys, thank you so much once more. Stay pretty, stay slain, and always smile. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.